Huina Excavator and MN45 with homemade trailer. Homemade. First day at the construction site and it's a snowy day. Hope you all enjoy. We're gonna pop wheelies. Yeah, it's Crawler Course 1 slash Construction Zone. The Gravel Pit. Or Sand Pit, whatever you want to call it. Such a steep trailer angle, I had to use the excavator arm to walk the excavator off and not tip it over. That's why it looks funny. You can see the truck move a little bit while I shift the excavator's weight. That little toy's a blast. Here, we'll just move the trailer over a little bit. There we go. All right, we're on the ground now. Look at that trailer angle. I brought it down that. It's like almost straight up and down. It's because I got it stuck. You can see the pile of snow. All right, it's time to have some fun with this thing. Found out if you keep the arm forward, it makes it a lot easier to dig down little by little. And it also puts the weight on the front of the tracks. Makes it a lot easier to plow, it gives you more traction. I had a blast with this little thing. I'm not sure what model number of Huina excavator it is. It's just the one with the front blade. That's all I know. That front blade's so cool. That was the reason I wanted it. My wife bought it for me for our anniversary. It was my anniversary present from her. An excavator. Twelve year marriage anniversary. She obviously knows me pretty well, huh? Dodge well, for Christmas, she got me the Tioga and the Slash. I bought myself the MN and souped it up. Look how tough that snow is, man. Yep. It's the bench we normally sit on over there. Try to drive from way over there by the French doors. The circus tent building is my smokehouse in the background for my smoker. Get some gnarly winds up here during the winter and I like to be able to smoke my food all year. Enough about that, let's back to playing with the excavator, yeah, yeah. That the snow doesn't come out of <laughs> can I move this weed with it? Nope. You can see it trying though. Eh. <laughs> I almost tipped myself over. And I'll just move the camera a little bit. <laughs> I gotta break it up. That's the only way. This is gonna take forever. There we go. It's oh. not like fresh snow either. 
No, the snow is like three, four days old. I'm just now getting to it after all the other videos. And I decided, you know, I haven't really done any videos with the uh, excavator. In fact, I don't think I've done any. It's time to do a video with the excavator. Show how cool it is. And it's little flashy lights. It's actually moving the camera like it's shaking the ground like a real excavator. Yeah, get some. First, you gotta shove it into a pile, then you break it up, and then you shove it off. So, on a little catwalk up here, one of my other videos, the uh, snow wheeling video with the CR12, shows me driving around up there. Well, the snow got too, for lack of a better word, crappy. So, I had to get rid of it. <laughs> but hey it makes for great footage with the excavator gives me a chance to bring it out and test my skills that I didn't have until this video it's like the first time I've actually gotten to really play with it actually use its features the ground's been too hard otherwise doesn't do much in hard ground it doesn't have hydraulics it's electric actuated it's cool that you can move the blade up and down though mm -hmm. well, I like that it came with the front blade it was the only model that had it I thought that was just neat yeah I went in doubt just used the claw to break it up it works really well Almost drove it off the edge there. You can see the thing's actually doing work. Ooh. I used the excavator arm oh. to hold it on the other side. On the other. <laughs> the other catwalk. I was looking ahead of it. Oh, we're almost there. You can see the trailer in the background. Memorial Yep. Try to get it stuck. Nope. That thing does amazing. As long as you don't get the tracks too full of snow. I had to clean them out a couple times. You see in this video, they're clogged up. Slightly, and it's still working. I mean, don't get me wrong, it's still doing its job. Like, oh, well, that's not working, fine. Get a nice scoop here. Need to get the snow out of here. The dump truck can't drive through it. I don't know if you guys know much about the Huena series uh, construction toys, but the dump truck and the loader get high centered really easy. I mean, like, really easy. So, yeah, it'd be impossible to get that through here right now. Now, I watched this video on Fast Forward, and this was my favorite one. Yeah, it's my favorite clip, too. Actually moving the snow with the excavator arm. getting better with it get better as time goes on I bet there's some little kid out there that could just operate the crap out of this thing and make me look like hey look this guy's having a hard time figuring it out 
does look like what, an Xbox controller. <laughs> it does look like an Xbox controller. And being a Nintendo kid growing up, well, y'all know. I love my Nintendo and my Sega Genesis. I see, I had to clean the tracks out towards the end of the video. It was uh, turning right only. Very easy to clean. You just take the track off the rubber and kind of flex it and knock the stuff off and put it back on. Not that big a deal. But, dude... Off switch. Three batteries, and I got all this work done. That pretty much is the finished product right there. I got the rest of it shoved into a pile. We got the whole catwalk clear. And I'm done for the day. See, got all that pile out of there. There's the finished product, guys. That would have been like a 30, 40 minute video, so I had to kind of speed it up. Sorry, it's 11 minutes. Hope y'all got time to watch it. Now I'm back in the trailer onto the catwalk with the No More MN. That took some skills. You can see the chains dragging for the ramps in the center there. And the trailer chains hooked to the truck. Oh, I got the lights turned on properly this time. It's getting dark. I needed my lights not flashing to see where I was going. I'm going to get this all set where it goes to give me a little bit of tongue weight. All loaded, ready to go. We're going to do wheelies. Yeah, yeah. Look at that angle. That was crazy. <laughs> anyway, I hope you all like this video. If you did, please like and subscribe. Thank you.